Yalar. Ha. Bit. Dede. It's pot of fucking loud. Camp at Twizel Castle. It's an old, old haunted castle. It's absolutely amazing. It's actually underground as well. We've got like three or four rooms we can stay in. So we're going to be checking these out. And I'll bring you back as we get started and set up. Right, guys, that is us all set up. Tents are set up, ready to camp. We're going to wait for it to get a bit darker. We're going to investigate this place. It's absolutely amazing. I love how the vines are just growing over the windows. It looks mint. So I'll have a brew. I'm gonna have a brew and chill for a bit until we get the investigation started. Mm. This place is amazing. Just stand at one of the windows. Yeah, so that's nearly coiled between on. That about 30 seconds. So guys, I'll bring you back when it gets dark. I'll see you shortly. Can you do that again? Go on, do that again. Well, there's something here. Make these lights go off on this box. Can you make a noise to let me know that you're here? There's a big drop, guys, on the other side of here. Just up six foot out there, drops down to the river. And these would see the light. You know what I mean? Is anyone here? Can you light that box up? Can you make the light go? Is 
there's my tent set up directly in the middle of the castle my doorway for my tent so we're looking the rest of the doorways down there which I'm not happy about Well, if there's anyone here from that used to live in this castle want to come forward and say their name now's your chance come on tell me your name Can you tell me the name of the castle? Is that you making the making the device light up? Yeah. Can you tell? Can you tell me? Can you tell? Me? Tell us your name. Your name. Your name. Is that a yes? Come through on this device and tell us your name. Was there people killed here? Can you say my name? No. Come on, come through and say my name or Scott's name. Do that confirm that you're here? Is it Dave or Scott? So it's a Dave. Was that Dave? If that was a yes, can you light that machine up? Deal. Light that machine up. Deal. Deal. Dave. It's a Dave. Whoa. Was friend. that Dave? Were you trying to say Dave there? Yes. Just to clarify if that was a yes, can you light the machine up? Can you light that up if it was a yes? I said no twice there when you've asked it to do that. Why not? Help. Say help. Help. Are you stuck here? Do you roam around this castle? Are you trapped here? Are you stuck? Trapped. trapped. Say trapped back. straight away. Trapped. Can you not get out of here? Are you trapped in this castle? Are you stuck here? Are you stuck roaming, roaming around these walls? These castle walls? Can you light that machine up? If it's if it's who we're talking to. 
Can make that box play go? Go on, mate, go off. Can you say Scott? Or can you see my friend's name? Detective again. Can you see my name? Go on, say Scott. Say Scott to confirm that it's you. Scott. Say it again then. Is that you trying to say Scott? If so, can you let the box up? So I know it's you. There. Straight away. Thank you. Can you tell us can you tell us your name? So if I go through the alphabet, can you light that box up when it, when I get to the right initial of your first name? We'll start now. A B C D, E. Does your first name begin with E? Is your name Edward? Is that a yes to Edward? Come through and see Edward on this box. Did we stop there? Edward, what year did you die here? When was this built? I'm not sure. I don't really like to do any history research beforehand. Was it in 10,000? 11? 12? 13? Did you die in the 1300s? Was it 1300 you died here? Can you tell us how you died? Were you killed here? Let's see heaven. Are you in heaven? Have you got to a better place? Does it die? die. Was it the thir was it definitely in the thirteen hundred you died in? Can you light that up again? Definitely thirteen. Was it in between 1300 and 1310? 20? 30? Did you die in 1330? In between 1330 and 1340? And yeah, Come on, if there's someone here, use this app to see a name. on this 
up until the Janeum. Well, had Edward before. Edward who died in the 1300s. Edward's around here somewhere, do you mean? Guys, just start raining on me. Luckily for us, we're inside anyway. So we are going to keep investigating. So guys, if you've made it this far and you're enjoying this investigation, please smash that thumbs up. It helps so much with the channel, and it's really appreciated. They've upset me. Who's upset you? Can you tell me who's upset you? I so know there's not going to be anyone walking about in this rain. See, like we said that last time, there was people walking about in it, wasn't there? You can imagine this would have been like three, four stories high. It's absolutely amazing. A long spooky corridor, this guy's. Last time I was here through the day, I heard like such an, like, uh, a roaring noise. Like there was loads of people inside here talking, but dead low. It sounded like drums, it was freaking. What was that? I have memories. Eh? I have memories. I've just Do you have memories in this place? Which of these they were fairly positive. I didn't have memories. Come on, make a noise or make a bang. Throw something, let me know that you're here. Tired. You're tired. Have you used up a lot of energy making those meters go off? 
if you want you can use the energy from our equipment and try and drain it are you too tired to make a noise on this device and tell me your name. I told you mine and my friends. Candles. I will talk about having candles before. I haven't got any though. You can light something up for us though if you can. What your name's name. Can you tell me your name? Not unless he pisses off. Hmm? Not unless he pisses off. <laughs> See, not unless he pisses us off. <laughs> right, I'm going to use the S box if you can come through and speak on this. Come through and tell me your name. Your name, Edward. Come on, tell me your name. You can tell us what kind of building we're standing in.
Castle, this is Palace of Castle. It's about half twelve, one o'clock at night. Absolutely pitch black in here now. I hope you enjoy this investigation so far. Smash those likes, guys. It really helps the channel. And Dave really appreciates it. <laughs> right, guys, we're going to chill out for a little bit. We'll bring you back if anything else happens. Right, guys, we've just noticed the ceiling is absolutely covered with spiders. Absolutely everywhere dropping. Mm -hmm. Right, guys, we're going to try and get a bit of sleep. We'll bring this back if anything happens. We'll get any activity through the night. So, guys, we'll speak to you soon. Sorry, right, guys, you've just been sitting in the tent. For a bit, and I heard like a uh, noise. It was going. And it kept doing a dead loud behind us. I have no idea what it is or where it's coming from. I will play it now and enhance the footage for you to see so you can hear it. It's freaking us out. Yeah, it's going. I just I done it when I was doing it, eh? Yeah, that. Eh. Meat. Did the. Uh... It's proper fucking loud. There's something fucking hissing that way. The gas is on, mate. It's got to come from behind us. Go out there. Go out there, that doorway behind us. This one, how? Oh. Back there. Fuck off, I know, sir. The gas is uh, locked though, could it not be that? No, yeah, it's not that. Well guys, we've made it through the night. It's now morning again. I'm just telling the camera that it's morning again. Good morning guys. Pretty done in life. <laughs> well, last night was all right. We had some weird noises as we went to sleep. But yeah, other than that, it was quite a peaceful night. Anyway, guys, we're going to get packed up, head back down to the car. Let's catch us in five.
just all packed up. See, I've got my double bags on. We're leaving the castle now. Absolutely amazing night. I look half asleep. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed it. Smash those likes. We'll see you guys on the next video.